case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1978, the Supreme Court of the United States heard the case of Baldwin v. Fish and Game Commission, which focused on whether states could make distinctions between residents and non-residents in terms of wildlife conservation and regulation. A group of non-resident hunters and a Montana resident outfitter had filed a federal lawsuit in 1975, objecting to the state's elk hunting licensing system, as non-residents had to pay significantly more for a hunting license than residents did. They claimed that this disparity violated the Constitution's Privileges and Immunities Clause and Equal Protection Clause, and sought reimbursement for fees already paid. The case was initially heard by a three-judge district court, which denied all relief to the plaintiffs. On review, the Supreme Court, with Justice Blackmun delivering the majority opinion, found that there were disparities in the licensing system, but no justification for the cost difference. However, the court ultimately ruled that the elk hunting license fee differential between Montana residents and non-residents did not violate the privileges and immunities or equal protection clauses. The court maintained that the state's approach was rational, as it limited hunting days and protected wildlife without unreasonably burdening interstate commerce. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.